People who regularly use one Baldwin County intersection say there needs to be a traffic light there. A serious crash last week raised even more concerns. A light was supposed to be installed last year near Stonebridge Elementary School on Highway 31, but as WKRG News 5's Blake Brown explains, funding stalled that project. Sherry Cribbett says this intersection is dangerous and she's begging the city of Loxley for help. We saw a significant accident last Friday where a vehicle uh, rolled and a semi jackknifed. Luckily, the person walked away. Bedrock Boulevard at Highway 31 is the entrance to Stonebridge Elementary School, and it also connects to hundreds of homes. Cribbett says she worries more accidents will happen here if something isn't done soon. We've almost been hit head on twice, and many other neighbors as well. The city of Loxley and state transportation officials had hoped to have a traffic light installed before the school first opened last year, but the cost of the project came in $300,000 over budget, making the final price tag close to $1 million. While the new cost hasn't been made public. We're told funding has been approved and improvements at the intersection are coming soon. The city of Loxley plans to start on the traffic light project next month with the Alabama Department of Transportation. City officials say, quote, the traffic signal has been approved and was set to begin work January 1st, but due to not being able to get materials, the start date has now been pushed back to mid to late February. Cribbett says she's glad the project is moving forward, but wants to see something done now in the meantime before someone gets hurt. Get us some temporary help. Uh, can we have some flashing lights? Can we have some police presence at the high times? We don't need any, any crosses and memorial wreaths on that intersection. We need help. Once the materials are in, it will likely take a couple of weeks to complete the traffic light installation. In Baldwin County, I'm Blake Brown, WKRG News 5.